내가 Welcome all. Thanks for tuning in to 2K Sports. We've got some NBA action coming up for you. Alongside Grant Hill and Brent Berry, I'm Brian Anderson. Also with us tonight, our reporter, Ali LaForce. Here are the five for the Lakers. Reeves and LeBron fill out the perimeter. Vanderbilt at power forward with Davis in the middle. And it's Slim in at the point guard position. And for the Wizards, Kyle Kuzma out there with Denny Avdia. Then it's Daniel Gafford, and then it's Landry Shamit, and it's Poole in at the one. And now that we're late into the season, Grant, what do you think teams are trying to accomplish? Well, you know, B.A., for the playoff teams, it's all about getting the best seed and matchup possible. And, of course, for those lottery teams, just continuing to develop and build winning habits. Off goes to the Lakers. James outside. Pass to Slim. James a screen on Poole. And he lobs it up to the rim. Can't complete the lob. And so it's Poole who brings up the ball for the Wizards. Defeated by Milwaukee in their last game. They'll try to put that one behind them. <laughs> there obviously was a breakdown at the defensive end. They gave away too many clean looks. Yeah, sometimes you can play good on-ball defense, but it's the help defense that makes you elite. And on that night, nobody rotating and not a lot of help. That's as sweet as you're going to get it. Fluid motion, great lift, rolls right off the fingertips. Here's Avdia. He's coming off a 10-point game against Milwaukee. He also had two blocks that really impacted that game, guys. He really made his presence known. Here's Slim, guarded by Poole. Davis, the pass to Slim. Deflected! Pass to Poole. Gafford against Vanderbilt. Now here's Kuzma. Gafford with a screen on James. Kuzma, the pass to Avdia. Just five on the clock. Here's Shamit. No good on the three. The Lakers have gone one for three so far. James passes to Slim. Outside Vanderbilt. Here's Slim. Last game out, we saw him score 42. The Lakers got to get one up. Late clock. Here's Reeves. Tipped. And so far, the team just one of five, and that rim shrinking. Poole finds Gafford. Poole with the ball. From 13, and it's good for two. And this game is tied up now. And Poole knocks that one down without worry. Well, from late first round pick to big time score, the rise of Jordan Poole has been fun. Well, he earned himself a pretty lucrative contract after a couple of years of trying to figure out what it is that he does best. I think we know what that is, B.A. Put points on the board. This guy plays with a ton of offensive confidence. So it's Washington now. The Lakers getting their last shot to go. Vanderbilt pulls it in. This is a rough stretch right here for him offensively. It seems to be rushing shots. Here's Slim, guarded by Poole. Slim with a bucket. Slim's got six. 
The defensive effort was lacking a bit, but hey, give them credit for finding a weakness there. Just really smart basketball and exploiting whatever holes that he's seeing right now in the defensive squad. Yeah, here's a list of things I don't want to do, and right at the top is guard that guy. Reeves, the pass to Slim. And first quarter, we're about three and a half minutes in. And he lobs it up, and it's James with the jam. Now that looked easy. Two of the easier points for LeBron James in this ball game. Washington has gone 0 for 2 from outside. Pass to Gafford. Here's Poole. Now Gafford. Back to Shamit. Here's Kuzma. Checked by James. Releases. Rebound by the Lakers. They put up a nice win against Toronto last time out. And most of the arena was totally against them. But they looked inward, trusted each other, and made good plays. Yeah, and in that game, it turned into a massive scoring night. It wasn't so much about the, the game plan as it was establishing early confidence to get that win. The first one falls. Grant, you grew up here in Washington, D.C. What's the hoop scene like here? Well, B.A., they love the game of basketball here. And the fans are unbelievable. So many stars from here, like Kevin Durant. So D.C. is kind of a sneaky, underrated basketball city. Now here's Poole. He had a 36-point outing in their last game against Milwaukee. Right now, firing on all cylinders. Yeah, there's a nice flow to this offense right now. And book it for Vanderbilt. And a great vision by Davis showing off those point guard skills from back in high school. And it's Poole with the ball for Washington. They trail by nine. The Lakers beat them last time when these two met in Los Angeles. Today's game is about effort and energy. They got crushed on the glass the last time these teams played. Well, let's see if the lesson was learned from that loss. If they come out with the same type of effort, they can expect a similar result here. Here's Slim. Give him eight points now. Great work by the team there to find AD. They make eye contact, and the rest of that is history. And here's Poole. With the 10-footer. Again, the miss by Poole. Practically a block. <laughs> Good, strong challenge. Yeah, altering the shot just as long as there's a miss. That kind of energy not wasted. Just so successful getting the ball inside and finding those great looks. Here's Shaman. Hasn't gotten one to fall yet. Poole outside. And looks like an illegal pick was set. That gets the ref's attention. And with the end of the regular season in sight, here are the latest power rankings. Taking a look at Milwaukee, they're a rising team climbing to fifth on the board. Seeing where Los Angeles is, they've really found their identity as a team, managing to establish themselves as serious contenders. D'Angelo Russell, he's checked in for Reeves. To the right side. And here's Vanderbilt from the arc. And the Lakers hit again from deep. And this defense needs to turn the screws and ramp up the intensity. They're looking a little loose out there right now. Poole, the pass to Gafford. Here's Shaman, guarded by Russell. Gafford with a screen on Russell. Shaman. Oh, and again, unable to change momentum here. Here's Slim. He's got 10. And Davis slams it home. Building a big advantage early with a terrific all-around performance. Well, if I was baking up a lead, I'd add two ingredients. One would be playing smart. The other one, playing selfless. They've done that tonight. Serve it up. Here's Poole. The Lakers getting their last shot to go. And the shot goes in. Poole extending himself and finishing over the defense inside. Here's Slim. And Gafford with the block. Pass break. Here we go. Takes the assist and lays it in. Nice setup. There are only a few players in the league who can hit a teammate like that in stride. Beautiful assist. Russell to pass to Slim. Ooh, a two-handed power slam. 
They've shown so much energy right from the start, particularly on the offensive end. Yeah, if you walked in at any point during this game to watch five minutes of play, one team played harder. You know who that was. Now here's Gafford. He's scoreless. Poole outside. Pass to Avdia. Launches it. Rebound, Anthony Davis. Los Angeles has gone two for three from outside the arc. Vanderbilt, no good. Washington has gone one for five from three-point range. A cold start. Pool outside. Fires from deep. Rebound by the Lakers. Surprising to see him miss here, but they'll be happy with that shot in most possessions. Outside for Russell. Vanderbilt with a screen. Pass to Slim. To the inside. And book it for Vanderbilt. Vanderbilt's got eight. <laughs> they are passing the ball around tremendously right now. Here's Avdia. Now Kuzma. Checked by James. It's Kuzma with the miss. No question who's in control of the board so far. And it's James with the jam. Really taking charge of the game. Largely with a detailed interior attack. Well, how good have they been on the inside tonight? Just getting down into the painted area. Just dominating, controlling that spot. So it's Washington now. After the Lakers picking up a basket just moments ago. James against Kuzma. Gafford with a screen on James. Kuzma for three. He drains that one after two misses. Now one for three. And this is where Kuzma wants to just keep improving, find some consistency. He knows guys like him have to keep hitting threes to stay on the floor. Here's Slim. 12 points for him. Vanderbilt, the pass to Russell. He drops it from range. And the Lakers lead by 17. <laughs> I just love the ball move. Now a timeout called by Washington. Oh my, their coach does not look happy. And I can guess why. Their interior defense has been struggling. No, they're not preventing them from scoring. And if you can get to a high efficiency shot on the floor, and that's the paint, you just keep going. So for the Wizards, Muscala, he's checked in for Avia. Vincent comes in for Kuzma. And it's Jones in for Shamit. Christian Wood is checked in for Los Angeles. Achimura comes in for James. Anthony Davis. All right, guys, what do you think so far about the offensive approach for the Lakers? They've done a great job facilitating shooters. Their early game has seen a lot of hot passes has kept the defense guessing as well. well. They've done a great job tonight of getting out in transition, so that focus on fast break adds to your total in a hurry. Los Angeles has gone three for five from deep so far in this matchup. Driving to the basket, shrugs off the contact and dunks it home. He'll go to the line. Sometimes it's the simple play that's most effective. D'Lo with a nice assist. Here's Vincent. Looking at the numbers, he's putting up seven points a game. Five to shoot. Gafford with a screen on Achimura. Vincent offline with a three. And it's Wood with the ball for the Los Angeles Lakers. It's an 18 point lead from the arc. And another three for the Lakers. They've really built this lead on the back of their perimeter game. Well, a lot of importance placed on outside shooting. And tonight you can see why after that kind of quarter exploding from the perimeter. Now here's Muscala. Here's Jones. Softly drops in the floater. Showing off with the floater game. Not a shot you can swat. Los Angeles has gone four of six from deep to start this game. Slim with a bucket. Slim's got 17 points. The D hasn't been quick enough to react to the ball inside. That's helped cause this run. Pass to Gafford. Outside Jones. Davis with the block. No surprise why AD has led the league in blocks before. Over Gafford. And there's another one for the Lakers. 
and just executing at a high level. I mean, taking what the defense allows and putting in the work. Basketball IQ is something that gets talked about, but it's importance to a team showing up here, running plays that turn into scores. Here's Poole. After the Lakers picking up a basket just moments ago, Gafford with a screen on Russell. Poole for three. Wood grabs the board. Now Los Angeles with it. They're on a 19-7 run. Hachimura, the pass to Slim. And he jams it after taking the nice feed on the run. Who doesn't love to see David take on Goliath? Their huge throwdown. Well, the Wizards shooting 33% in the first quarter. Things just don't seem to be clicking for them offensively. Yeah, they really need to find a way to get back on track. Here's Vincent. And Davis with the block. Here's Slim. Into the lane. That one's true. And that's 9 for 12 for him now. And another great assist. The offense is really clicking now. Poole outside. Pass to Jones. Puts up a three. Gets the three to fall. Jones has got his second bucket on the night. Poole becoming a better distributor of the basketball. So finding those chances and trying to get guys better looks, that's part of his game. We're at the end of the first, and what a blowout already in this one. The Lakers on top, delivering the blowout. And back to the start of the second quarter in just a moment. If you're just tuning in, we've got a wide margin on the scoreboard, but plenty of time left for a comeback. And guys, Lakers look pretty much in control here. Oh, what a first quarter. You love their willingness to make the extra pass. So much unselfish play out there. The coaching staff has to be thrilled with that. So on the floor for the Lakers to kick off the second quarter. They've got Rui Achimura. He's out there with Prince. Christian Wood out there with D'Angelo Russell. And it's Slim in at the point. Well, guys, Slim in the last outing against the Raptors got the job done. He contributed 42 points, and he also dished out plenty of assists, something we're used to seeing. He just went out there and played his game, absolutely owning the opposition in the process. Back to you guys. All right, Alec, thanks for the update. It'll be interesting to see if he can heat up once again tonight, Grant. Yeah, you know he wants to do exactly this, B.A. Just needs to continue to play with the same fire and energy. And you want to see him make sure that the teammates are also involved in what they're doing, especially if he draws that much attention. Now here's Russell. He picked up 12 points in their last win against Toronto. Off the mark there with a three. For Washington, they've got none of their first three shots to fall so far in the second. Vincent passes to Gill. Back to Vincent. The three ball drops in the three. Vincent's gotten himself going with a triple, his first basket of the game. No way he's going to pass that shot up. The D is way too far back and relaxed in getting out on him. Hachimura with a screen on Jones to the paint. And it's slammed in by Hachimura. And Rui getting up and getting after it on the lob. Here's Jones. He had a 12-point outing in their last game against Milwaukee. Well, his passing another high point in that game. He made sure it wasn't all about him. He wanted to get his teammates involved. Here's Gill. Kuzma, left side. All alone. That's good on the jumper. Kuzma's got five. And Kuzma with tremendous confidence. He feels like he can hit it from anywhere on the floor. Well, as a champion and a 20-point-per-game score, Kyle Kuzma has exceeded all expectations for him. Well, I like the recovery of Kyle Kuzma. You know, he had the early years where he was successful and then maybe lost himself in some things and has found his way back to a consistency that I think the organization he plays for is appreciating. They call him Clutch Kuz for a reason. He does love those big moments. Washington with the ball. The Lakers getting their last shot to go. Jones misses. Here's Slim. And he'll draw the foul. He'll head to the line for two. Well, the saying is defense wins championships. 
But in this day and age, don't you need both? No question, B.A., you definitely do. I mean, we've seen plenty of great defenses flame out in the playoffs because they couldn't put up points. Defense alone isn't enough. You need a balance of both. Avdia, he's checked in for Washington. Shannon comes in for Vincent. The Lakers also with a sub. Reeves is checked in. Washington's gone two of five from distance here in the second quarter. Outside Jones, pass to Muscala. And here is Kuzma, five on the clock. Wing shot on the way. Slim with the rebound. For Los Angeles, they've gone three of five since the beginning of the second. Russell, the pass to Slim. He gets it in there. Slim's got 31. <laughs> They're not messing around. Five of their last six buckets have come from the interior. On the wing, Kuzma. Back to Jones. Takes the three. It's Shamit on the wing, guarded by Russell. That shot off. Some solid D from Wood. Shot from the wing. And that one hits the back iron. And so it's Jones who brings up the ball for Washington. Following this one, they host the Trailblazers. And Hachimura at 6'8". No problem for him to get up. And for Washington, they're shooting just around 33% since the second quarter got underway. Jones up top. Five points in the game. Another shot. Here's Kuzma. He got a piece of it. Here's Slim. Pass to Wood. Over Muscala. Wood misses. A lot of defenders choose to just back up off of him when he's in that tight, try to avoid the and one, and this time, they're not backing off. And their physical dominance has been on display. A 10-rebound advantage is a good indicator of how this game has gone. Here's Russell. Ooh, plenty of contact on that shot. The officials call the foul, and he'll take two free throws now. Well, Russell, throughout the course of the game, wants to constantly put pressure on the defense. He did so there. Gafford, he's checked in for Washington. Anthony Davis, he's checked in for the Lakers. LeBron comes in for Achimura. Washington has gone 2 of 5 from distance here in the second quarter. It's Avdia on the wing. Pulls it from the corner. The Lakers with a rebound. Great defense. Can't let guys get open looks inside the arc. Pass to James. Here's Slim, defended by Jones. Here's Slim. Russell, the pass to Slim. And it's good with time running down on the shot clock. Slim's got nine points in the quarter. Boy, they need something to go to regain some confidence. No question, way too many empty possessions for them. Kuzma, the pass to Jones. Davis with the block. Well, his poor shooting is a big reason that they're staring at this deficit right now. He needs to get on track. If they're going to find a way to win. First team foul. And that one misses. And already at such a young age, Landry Shamit considered one of those critical role pieces for a very good team. Sky's still the limit for where he can get to. The Wizards making a switch here. Fools checked in. Christian Wood is checked in for Los Angeles. Jones misses. Well, his shooting this quarter has to be a huge concern, especially when they're behind like this. Can he find a rhythm? Well, the Wizards shooting a rough 29% from the field here. Pass to Poole to end the drought. Wood grabs the board. Wood's got six rebounds in the game. They've shown the power inside. Their rebounding effort has been sensational. Here's Slim. That's in there. Davis with the assist. Slim's got 36 points. Jones, the pass to Gafford. Now here's Poole. A high arcing shot. Pass to Slim. 
Back to James. From downtown. And another three for the Lakers. Their defense has to do a better job of smothering those shooters. Jones with the ball. Five points in the game. Gafford finds Poole. Back to Gafford. And the dunk by Gafford. And Poole's vision developing right in front of us. Here's Slim. And here are the Lakers. They're on an 18-7 run. Cross is over. And the shot counts. He's fouled. And it's a chance for a three-point play. Hachimura's checked in for the Lakers. Shooting for Los Angeles. Number... Washington has gone two of six from distance here in the second quarter. Jones, the pass to Gafford. Poole with a ball. Just five to shoot. The Wizards need to get off a shot here. Took the opportunity when he saw it. Jones has got his third basket on the night right there. In terms of scoring, this hasn't been his quarter. Just one of seven. Here's Slim. Outside for Davis. The three sinks it from distance. Davis has got nine. The assist numbers certainly stand out. They've really emphasized ball movement here today. Back to Jones. Poole outside. Gafford the screen. Poole with the ball. And Davis picks him up defensively. Jones from outside. And the Wizards with another three. And that's his second in this quarter, guys. He's made three so far this game and is showing no signs of slowing down. Slim, the pass to Achimura. Here's Slim, defended by Jones. Reeves. And another three for the Lakers. And both teams running long-range plays that are working. Well, both of them looking towards the three-point line. And I like to see that, especially when the results are made buckets. Now here's Poole. He's got nine. Gafford in the post. Checked by Davis. You know, altered shots don't show up on the official stat sheet. But as we saw there, he does a great job of doing that as well as collecting the rebound. Blocked! All right, let's check in with Allie LaForce. Well, the Wizards not making the playoffs the last couple of seasons motivated them to bring in some youth in Jordan Poole, and the players say that they've seen dramatic improvements from player facilities, energy, and player development. They said they're transitioning, they're going in the right direction, but they still have a lot of improvements to make. Good point, Allie. Thank you. And Gafford with the block. Poole finds Jones. And here's Gafford. Pass to Poole. Shoots over Davis. And another miss by Washington. I know he's on a cold streak, but he can't let that get in his head. Especially if you're a player that doesn't get a lot of shot attempts. But otherwise, the mindset is, I just got to get the next one to go. And you don't want to put that much pressure on yourself. Slim with a bucket. Down the stretch, he's been flat out awesome. He helped them get the lead, and now he's making sure they keep it. There's a minute 17 left in the first half of basketball. Jones, the pass to Avdia. Here's Poole. Pass to Shamit. Let's the three fly. Knocks down the long J. Shamit's got six. Yeah, he couldn't connect on anything from outside. Oh, 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 hey, oh, how about that? That's impressive. Uh, this is uh, sometimes Never LeBron just likes to take it all out on the rim. That time on display. On the AT&T 5G Slam Cam, good looks by our terrific camera crew. And so it's Jones who brings up the ball for the Wizards. There's 48 seconds left to play in the first half. Gafford passes to Poole. Looking to get it going. That one rolls around and rims out. 
Well, if he's going to keep shooting, they've got to run some plays for him. Screens, pick and rolls, anything they can do to get him started. To the middle. And slam dunk by James. Great awareness from LBJ. Great at slashing off the ball. Open space available. He filled it. 24 seconds left in the second period. Now here's Poole. Tight defense on him. The three is up. That shot missing. And so it's the Los Angeles Lakers showing no mercy and just piling it on, looking dominant and focused right now. Their efficiency has been off the charts. They're running their sets well with patience and purpose. We'll be right back after this word. Put your hands together, man. Welcome, everybody. This game revealing a big disparity in play. What a performance so far for the Los Angeles Lakers. Hey, this is their style of basketball. Pushing the tempo, getting easy points in transition. Literally, they're running away with this game. Yeah, they're running off main shots. They don't care. All right, and now time to give some recognition. Players of the Month. Out in the East, James Harden. Built to carry an offense. It always seems like Harden's up for this award. But this last stretch has been next level. His legs look fresh. He's 100% focused. Tough matchup for anyone right now. And that'll do it for us. Thanks for stopping by. We'll head back down to Brian Anderson and crew for the start of the third quarter. Scoreboard. The second half begins with very different goals for these teams. One side trying to mount a comeback, one side trying to protect their lead. Here's Avdia. Jordan Poole out there with Landry Shamet. Then there's Kyle Kuzma. Then it's Denny Avdia. And it's Gafford in at the five, roaming the paint. That's the group for Washington right now. Poole shot is off. A rough game for him scoring the ball. Just can't seem to get it going. And Gafford with the block. And they're able to recover. Vanderbilt, a screen on Poole. Pass to Reeves. From outside the arc, Avdia pulls it in. Avdia's got his seventh rebound of the game with that last one. Here's Shamit. 
cool outside. Back to Gafford. And he banks in the layup. Gafford's got six. Now their plan working to perfection there if that was their plan. And if it wasn't, maybe that should be their plan. Davis with a screen on pool. Here's Slim. The offensive rebound. And guys, the way this defense is getting manhandled down low, you have to wonder if they're at 100% right now. And with a little over a minute gone by, the second half is underway. Shamit passes to Gafford. Now here's Kuzma. Pass to Poole. Six to shoot. Gafford up top. Here's Avdia. Let's go with a three. Davis with a rebound. Third quarter of play with just over one and a half minutes gone by. Everyone in the building saw the obvious contact. Third personal foul. And he drops the first. Shooting for Los Angeles. Hits both from the stripe. Here's Poole. He's got nine. Boy, they'd love if anyone could get a bucket. Yeah, their offense has been grinding to a halt. And Poole up ahead of the defense on that pull-up in a hurry. Here's Slim, guarded by Poole. The three. Shot is good by Reeves. Reeves has gotten his second bucket. Have to get out on him. He'll burn you from there repeatedly. Here's Shamit. Six points for him. Poole. Oh, the teardrop falls in. 13 points in the game. And no lack of confidence from Jordan Poole on a floater like that. Davis, a screen. Throws it up high. And an emphatic jam on the lob. Gliding the pass to where it needed to be. Wow, a strong finish to seal the deal. The Wizards have gone three of five from the field in this third quarter. Avdia passes to Poole. Well, we're into the third quarter. Just over two and a half minutes played. Davis with a rebound. Davis has got rebound number 10 tonight with that last one. And there's James from the arc. And the Lakers hit again from deep. Well, they're clicking on all cylinders right now, beginning to pull away. Well, game plan might have been good, but you have to bring it together. Right now, their chemistry is something to be admired. Now here's Poole. He's got 13. Here's Shamit. There's the three. The Lakers with a rebound. Vanderbilt's got his eighth rebound here tonight. Reeves, the pass to Slim. Vanderbilt with it. Pass to Slim. Back to James. Ooh, now seven for nine after that make. His efficiency has been a big factor in helping them capture this lead. Now Poole, a guy this team turns too often, averaging almost 24 a game. And that one drops. Not just the accuracy in the quarter, it's his movement and the energy that's getting him on this nice roll. Here's Slim. And he lobs it up top! And slam dunked by James. Incredible feel for the game. LeBron knows when it's his job to set the tone offensively. For Washington, they've gone four of eight in the third. Shamit passes to Poole. There's a screen. Here's Gafford. Kuzma outside. Pass to Poole. Tries again. Here's Gafford. Again with the block. A defensive stalwart so far. That's six blocks. Protecting the rim well. Love the hustle. And just another weapon that Jordan Poole has in his offensive arsenal. Davis with a screen on Poole. Slim. The pass to Davis. Outside Vanderbilt. Now James. Outside Vanderbilt. Pass to Slim. Oh, and that one, no question, powered it down. And despite the height disadvantage, oh my, 
He just attacks that interior. Yeah, no stopping him on that play. Sometimes even the taller defenders are helpless to stop him. Poole, shot is off. Well, if he wants to make the defense work, he's got to start knocking down the threes. Only one so far in this game for him, and none since halftime. Let's see some of the numbers here for Anthony Davis. And over the last 10 games, he's been hitting the boards hard. He's been a different guy when it comes to rebounding. Out there battling and fighting, it's great to see that kind of hustle. First free throw is good. He's perfect from the line this time. If they keep hitting free throws at this clip, it'll help them seal the deal. Washington has got nothing to fall from outside in this third quarter. Shamit passes to Poole. This one for three. Pure from three-point range. Poole's got 20. It feels like the other four guys have disappeared at this point. He wants to be the one to get them back. Driving inside. Slim with a bucket. Looks like we're starting to see a pattern here. Not afraid to get in the paint and get wet. For Washington, they've gotten six of 14 shots to drop in this third quarter. They set the pick. Here's Shamit. Rebounded by the Lakers. Let's be honest. That's not a shot he should be taking. No, he, he should know better. He knows that's not his game, which is why we don't see him take that shot often. And force feeding the ball inside. I mean, no reason to go away from what's working. Here's Gafford. The Lakers getting their last shot to go. Pool outside. Here's Shaman. He's got six. Jacks up a three. And again, Washington with a triple. And Shamit doing what he does best, scoring from distance. That's some nice accuracy. Oh, wasted no time on that one. 20 points for him. Well, he hasn't missed yet, guys, and the defense is scrambling for answers to stop this hot start. Now here's Poole. 20 points for him. Davis with a rebound. Davis has got rebound number 12 here already in the game. Here's Slim. Goes back up. And that's two points on the layup. Davis has got six points in the quarter. We've seen that more than once today. An effortless basket inside. Now here's Poole. He's closely guarded. Count it. It's obvious he's taking it upon himself to try and keep them alive. Los Angeles has gotten two of four threes to fall here in this third quarter. To the wing on the left. Back to Vanderbilt. Pass to Slim. With the floater. And the layup is good. Slim's got 53 points. Defense shaking their heads. No idea how to stop him in this quarter. He's got him on the ropes. Pool outside. And a miss there on the triple. And the Lakers shooting has been incredible. 72%. The shot by Reeves, no good. Washington shooting about 42% on the third. Pool outside. Let's it go from deep. Again, the miss by Poole. And so it's the Lakers with it. Looking ahead, they've got the Cavaliers coming to town for their next one. And that kicks off a string of three home games for them. Stout defense comes from not only contesting the shot, but also grabbing the board. Pass to Gafford. Here's Poole, guarded by Vanderbilt. Here's Gafford on the take. And the dunk by Gafford. Poole showing he's more comfortable in that pick-and-roll setting. He can be dangerous. Slim. And again. And he's been dominant so far in this one. Shouldering the offense. Really taking it to the opposition. Muscala, he's checked in for Washington. Jones comes in for Kuzma. And the Wizards shooting 34% thus far in this game. Poole up top, guarded by Russell. Outside Jones. The three is up. 
Trains the triple. Jones has got 14. <laughs> Just incredible. I mean, he's really making it rain out there, knocking them down one after another. Kind of like he's in his living room right now. He's found a comfort zone. Once he gets that, the defense knows they're in trouble. And I love how he's pushing the tempo and creating for others. He does this game in and game out. Incredible. Nice to play with a point guard that takes pride in playmaking. It makes you move around just a little bit faster to get open spots. And some stats here, guys. The scoring breakdown for the Lakers. They feel like they have an advantage inside. And so far, they have done an excellent job exploiting it. Well, if we add another thing to it, it's about the urgency they've played with. I mean, you look at the eyes of these guys. They're focused, wanting to get up tempo, and that's helped them score on the fast break. Here's Slim. What an incredible scoring display he's putting on tonight. Back to Russell. Fires the three. Washington with a rebound. Poole's got four rebounds in the game. Pass to Koulibaly. On the wing, Jones. Let's it go from the baseline and nails it. Jones has got five points in the quarter. They're really looking to that inside game here in the second half. Getting away from taking a bunch of threes. Washington foul. All right, let's go to the 2K leaderboard and see which teams have been the NBA's best in the rebounding department. Number one, Los Angeles. And I love how active they all are on the glass. When a shot goes up, this team takes a gang rebounding approach to tracking down their boards. And the Wizards making a change here. Kuzma's checked in. And the Lakers also making a change. Prince has checked in for Vanderbilt. Los Angeles foul. Torian Prince. First personal foul. Second team foul. One forty-four left to play in the third quarter. Jones from outside. And the Wizards with another three. What a feed from Kuzma. I like it when he finds the open man, and so do they. Here's Slim, defended by Jones. And another dime for him. And that's his 20th assist. Wow. He's doing a great job at orchestrating the offense. Jones, the pass to Kuzma. Jones sets the screen. Three-pointer. It's Kuzma with the miss. Los Angeles has gone two of six from downtown here in the second half. Jones comes with a double team. Here's Slim, defended by Jones. Back to Russell, from deep. Knocks down the triple. Russell's got seven points in the game. No hesitation as D'Angelo Russell, someone who does not lack confidence. Pass to Jones. Muscala with it. Poole outside. Six on the shot clock. Over to the left wing. Benson can't hit. Los Angeles has gone three of seven from deep so far in the third quarter. Here's Slim. And yes! Another basket! 60 points. This guy can't be stopped right now. They've had no answer for him in this one. One second separating the shot clock and the game clock. Poole against Russell. Poole outside. To end the run. Unable to get that one. And so it's the Los Angeles Lakers making this game a no contest. They poured it on early and they've never let up. They've had incredible success defensively taking away good looks and pressuring shooters. We're coming right back. Don't go anywhere. a moment now as we take a look at our State Farm assist of the game. 
You have to love his unselfishness and ability to make those around him better. Great hands, great vision. That makes great things happen for your offense. Los Angeles decides to talk it over. Lakers timeout. One more time, DC family. Your Wizards dancer. And the Lakers looking at who they've got. We've got Christian Wood. Cam Reddish is out there with Jackson Hayes. Then it's D'Angelo Russell, and it's Slim in at the point guard position. Oh, connects again. That's 62 points. 62. Amazing. A remarkable performance from him so far. Pass to Gafford. Tries to break his ice. Cool, finds Gafford. And the dunk by Gafford. What elevation. He's a smaller but still determined big man. And he likes mixing it up with his impressive vert. Here's Slim. Outside Reddish. Here's Slim. Defended by Kuzma. Hayes for three. Avdia pulls it in. Avdia's got nine rebounds now. Pull for three. Here's Kuzma. Rebound by the Lakers. Everything right except the finish. Have to keep focus all the way through the play. Reddish passes to Slim. Hayes with it. Launches a three. Right side, Reddish. Pass to Wood. Second chance effort. There's another block. Oh, you can't throw the weak sauce around him. No, you can't, B.A. I mean, he's sending everything back. Here's Shaman, guarded by Russell. Kuzma, the pass to Gafford. Gafford with a screen on Hayes. Cool. Russell with the rebound. Well, he wants that one over again, I guarantee that. Nobody's even in the neighborhood. Down low. And Gafford with the block. It's Shamit on the wing. Misses the three. Los Angeles has gone one for five shooting from the arc here in the fourth. Slim. Another one falls. Amazing. Oh, he's been absolutely ridiculous in this game. The B.A., it feels like he can't miss. Kuzma outside. Pass to Avdia. It's tipped. Out of bounds. It'll be Washington's ball. And the Lakers making a change here. Achimura's checked in. The floor for the Lakers. Number 28. Really, Hachimura. The Wizards shooting 33%. This hasn't been their quarter. And that one's good. Cool. Easy look when the defender isn't fighting over the screen. And the coach over there just asking for one simple thing, and that's some effort. Got burned on that one. Pass to Reddish. He can't hit that time. Kuzma with the defensive effort. Pull for three. Up again. Controls the rebound and the putback. Gafford's got ten points here in the second half. He's been terrific tonight, and with a little help from the other guys on the floor, they might be able to turn this game around. Here's Slim. Let's it fly from 18. The rebound by the Wizards. Kuzma's got five rebounds in the game. Inside. Here's Gafford. That one's good. Seven for ten now. Have to take care of the defensive boards better than that. Yeah, you just can't afford to give up second chance opportunities again and again. They get it back. Wood passes to Reddish. Here's Slim. Back to Russell. 
Pass to Slim. And another shot. And Gafford with the block. Poole outside. Gafford with the ball. Guarded by Wood. And Gafford gets it to go. On the assist by Poole. And the Lakers shooting at around 60% on this one. Very efficient. Wood with the screen. To the inside. And Wood with the stuff. And what a complete performance we saw from them. A dominant win in every way for the Lakers. And it was a big-time performance across the board. They looked like they were having fun out there, Grant. <laughs> yeah, B.A., it was almost like watching a cat play with a mouse. I mean, they did pretty much anything they wanted to do out there today. And another victory added to their resume. This will be their 53rd win of the year. Only a two-game series, and they win both. They have to be satisfied with this. And even the opposing fans can't deny this was a sensational game for Slim. And with all these assists, it's obvious how well that you can see the entirety of the floor out there. If an easy bucket is to be had, he'll find it. Here's Slim. And he was fouled while in the act of shooting, so he'll take two free throws. Daniel Gaffer picks one up. First one falls for him. Shooting for Los Angeles. That's also good, so he hits both free throws. Now here's Poole. There's 38 seconds left in the game. Pass to Avdia. Here's Shamit. Takes a three. Hachimura with a rebound. Here's Slim. Going inside. Banked it in off the glass. You got to give them respect. They're doing everything they can to close this out. Love that the guys are staying aggressive late in this ball game, just not wanting to let go of the rope. And that one's good. Pool. And Pool has Poole. that unlimited kind of range. I wonder who influenced that. Here's Slim. Oh, some solid defense from Pool. Hook loose. And so it's the Lakers easily grabbing this one. This one wasn't even close. The hometown crowd was waiting for a miracle that never came. Yeah, and this team was consistent throughout. They met every challenge as they earned this dub. And that's going to do it tonight, folks, for our broadcast. So alongside Grant Hill, Allie LaForce, Brent Barry, and our entire 2K crew, I'm Brian Anderson saying thank you for watching. So long and good night, everyone.